Alright guys, we are back in my garage for another video, and today we are going to be talking about these new Flex Fuel Kits that are coming from a partnership with TMS as well as Bimmer Network. This Flex Fuel Kit was uniquely designed to fit the Toyota Supra as well as the G80 and G82 M3 and M4, basically for S58 vehicles as well. So I'm going to do a little bit of an unboxing to show you guys what you get with the kit. We'll kind of put it together to show you how it all works, and then we'll explain some of the benefits of this kit. So hopefully if you guys are looking at a flex fuel kit and this is something you're considering, this can give you the information you need to make that decision. Hopefully this helps you out. Now, as always, for everybody that's new to the channel, I create these videos to help keep you updated on the latest developments in our community, as well as discuss technical topics so that we have a better understanding of how our engines work. So if you're interested in more videos like that, be sure to subscribe because there will be a lot more coming out in the future. So like I said, this kit is made in partnership with Bimmer Network, who is a big channel sponsor, as most of you know and also Tensility Motorsports. They're actually a company that's local to Bimmer Network, and so they teamed up to actually develop this kit from the ground up, specifically for the Toyota Supra, as well as the G80 and G82. Now, if you guys are interested in buying this kit, check out the link down in the description. You can use code KERN417 for a little bit of money off as well. So again, just making it a little bit easier for you guys if you're interested in going this route. But the kit is really cool specifically because it sets you up for flex fuel. So you guys can see the packaging is really nice. The way that you open it up is flip open this front cover and then you open it up and all the components are inside. Now this is just a demo kit. So I don't have all the sensors and everything included in both of them. But this is just kind of to show you the difference. Primarily being this portion of the kit. You can see how long the actual fuel line is on the S58 kits compared to the Supra B58 kits. So just make sure that you're ordering the right one for your car so that the fuel line is the right length and everything else will work and install flawlessly. So we'll put this one away and I'll show you guys all of the components that actually come with the kit. And basically what we have here is this inlet fitting. This is a 90 degree fitting and you can see it has a connector just like what you would get on your stock fuel line. So this will plug into the hard line coming from the low pressure feed on your car. Then you have the actual flex fuel sensor. So this will read the ethanol content in your fuel line. If we take this off and then we can connect it right here. And then that's actually going to clip into this line. So this is the line that replaces your factory low pressure feed line. So your flex fuel sensor will snap into this part like that. And then you have the rest of your feed line here. Now this kit has a couple different options. Obviously, if you have port injection, you're going to want to use this with your mode of reflex. So you could actually plug in your reflex flex fuel harness right into here and that will send the ethanol reading to your reflex. And then this cap right here is basically plugging the dash six connector that you can run to your port injection, whether it's a spacer plate that goes in your intake manifold or if it's just a fuel rail on top of your intake manifold, you can basically unscrew this and then run a line to your port injection. Now, if you're not using port injection and you're sticking with DI only, you leave this cap on and then we're going to run this to our Zetronix ECA. And so this is basically the master module that's going to send the ethanol readings to your car. You're actually going to run this wiring directly to the footwell module and the passenger footwell. And that will send all of the ethanol readings directly to the DME so that your tune can automatically adjust for your ethanol content. So this will work with all the major tuning platforms, boot mode, MHD, Ecutech, whatever you would want to run to get your ethanol readings to your tune. It also comes with a wiring harness. So this is the harness that actually plugs into your flex fuel sensor. 
And then that plugs into here on the Zetronics unit. So that sends the ethanol reading to this. And then to send the data to your car, you're basically going to plug this one into this side. So this will send the signal out. And then this connector will plug into one of these two. You can use either one. Basically, screw this in. And then these pins are what you're going to wire into your footwell module. So you're actually going to get this little tool. And this basically allows you to pop the pins out in your footwell module. And then you pop these in to replace it. And then it also has the extra little connector that you're going to run those pins to. And that will plug into here. So... It's not really too complex of an install. I think they actually have the installation instructions up on the website now. So definitely click on that if you want a more detailed DIY on how that installs onto your car, how to run the wiring over to the passenger footwell to make sure that you can actually get that data to your DME. And it also shows you exactly which pins you're going to depin so that you can wire it up properly. It shows you all the colors and everything as well to help a little bit. But as always with stuff like that, it's most accurate to actually count the pins to make sure that you're pulling the right one. And that's how this all works. So this is a really cool kit. Also, something else I forgot to mention, this big canister right here is a 10 micron filter. So this is something that will help protect your fuel injectors. I know a lot of people are concerned about working on their fuel system. When you disconnect it, you can potentially introduce contamination into your fuel lines. So this will make sure that you keep everything clean. This is also, you know, serviceable, replaceable. So you can replace this every 50,000 miles or whatever uh, you're comfortable with to make sure that you always have a clean, high flowing fuel filter integrated into your fuel lines so that you don't damage, you know, your high pressure fuel pump, your port injection, etc. So yeah, I definitely think that this is going to be a good kit for those of you, like I said, the S58 guys, the B58TU guys, like the super guys that are looking for a flex fuel kit, especially one with an actual fuel filter and expansion for adding port injection in the future. You know, this is a nice modular setup you can grow into to make sure you're getting the ethanol readings you need to your car's tune so it can automatically adjust for it. So hopefully this answers any questions that you guys might have. If you do have any more, definitely leave a comment down below and I can try to address it. And just a reminder, again, you can use my code current 417 with the link in the description. If you want to buy this kit, it'll take a little bit of money off. And that also does help me out and help the channel grow as well. So yeah, I think that's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching and I hope this helps. And if you have any other questions or comments, leave them down below. Now, this kit has a couple different options. Obviously, if you have port injection, you're going to want to use this with your mode of reflex. So you could actually plug in your reflex flex fuel harness right into here, and that will send the ethanol reading to your reflex. And then you can take off this cap.